So we have here now Miss Issa Reyes from Neat Obsessions. So I asked help from Miss Issa Reyes of Neat Obsessions to keep everything tidy and organized. So as I tour you to our new kitchen, she'll be sharing with us some professional organizing tips. And yeah, that's very important for me because it's your personal space, especially our home, the right, Miss Issa. Dito nagsisimula lahat. Oh my God, I'm grateful. <laughs> Thank you. Pinadali ni Miss Isa yung buhay namin lahat dito. Sa kitchen pa lang. Second question. How does it feel like now? I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, back to your question, Miss Isa. So, second question. <laughs> sorry! Parang sense na ako. Especially pag dito sa kitchen. Hi! Sorry. No, sorry. <laughs> We just finished shooting her kitchen tour video and with me today is Catherine Bernardo! Hi! Hi everyone! You ready? Am I ready? Let's go! Hello fellow homemakers! <laughs> <laughs> so I'm Miss Isa. Hello! So I have a few questions long for you Catherine because we're done now with this kitchen renovation. Yes. And I'm very happy that you chose me to help you. Of course! So, oh my god, thank you, Miss Isa. Because I'm so busy with Miss Isa. So, um, I oh, really. I'm really. I'm really. It's really hard to make schedule. Namin. Uh, we've been planning to do a vlog for quite some time now, and finally it's happening. So, so thank, thank you. you! Thank you! For um, allowing me to do this with you. Oh my also. god, I'm grateful! <laughs> thank you! I'm really happy Miss Isa yung buhay namin lahat dito. Sa kitchen pa lang. I have a few questions like, regarding the process that we did with the entire kitchen renovation. Okay. Para at least the viewers will also understand like, paano ba nangyari yun? How mm -hmm. did we come up with the you know, idea of customizing some of the items yes. here in the kitchen? But, okay. first question, why okay. do you think it's important to have an organized kitchen or space? Oh my god, that's very important for me because Personally, um, every time I organize or declutter things, it reduces my stress. Mm -hmm. I don't know if it's like that din sa yung Lisa. Pero kasi parang kapag magulo yung surroundings ko or my space, feeling ko hindi ako nakaka-function din ng maayos. Like, it affects my mood. And then, ang dami na sasayag na time because di mo alam kung saan nakalagay. So for me, it's very relaxing. Every time I kita ko na everything's organized and just um, where they should be. Like, kasi sa Miss Isa, um, I met her like few years ago or last year ba? Few years yeah. ago. Yeah, like a year and a half ago. Okay, so I met her through DJ because um, she organized DJ's closet and then sakto nung time na yun, sobrang busy ko with work and then nakita ni DJ na naapektohan na yung mood ko kasi ang gulo yung closet ko. So I called Miss Isa and then luckily she said yes and we organized um, my closet. So dun nag start yung relationship ko with Miss Isa. And then ngayon, sinabi ko na, I need your help again because we're renovating the kitchen and I need someone, um, a professional home organizer to help me. So she agreed and that's the best decision because ngayon, parang alam ko na kung ano yun. Naakala ko before off off na ako. And then I met Miss Isa na, ang dami ko pang natutunan sa kanya along the way. And until now, I'm still learning. And yeah, that's very important for me because it's your personal space, especially our home, the Miss Isa. Dito nagsisimula lahat. So ngayon, parang sense na ako, especially pag dito sa kitchen, hi! Parang umaliwala siya, everything's neat and tidy, thanks to Miss Isa. I know, you sent me the photo of like how it looks like before. Before, yes. The CCTV shot uh, all the time. Yeah. <laughs> But yeah, it's very important for me because ngayon, alam ko na, nakakakilos na ako ng maayos. And ako personally, parang hindi, hindi na siya stressful tingnan. Mm -hmm. It brings peace in me. <laughs> Ikaw ba, Ms. Isa? Yeah, I love actually, organizing. Um, I love organizing because it makes my life more organized. More organized. No, more efficient. Yes. Because minsan kasi akala ng mga tao parang organizing mas lalong babagal yung buhay mo. Yes. Kasi parang, ay, 
you know, maglilipat pa ako ng mga Yeah, it's gonna take, it's not, yeah, a lot of your time, totoo. Diba, go and you have to put it back in the bin, parang mga ganun. Yes. Parang, parang pwede ko naman ipatong na lang. Yes. But the thing is kasi, parang for me, organizing should be, you have to treat it differently. Like, mm-hmm. parang organizing should help you understand like how you function on a day-to-day basis mm-hmm. and nang hindi ka na nag-iisip. Hindi halo-halo, parang it's kind of hard, lalo na mm-hmm. yung precision. Yes. So isang mawala mo na measuring spoon, di ba? Parang yeah. nag-iisip na siya. It's stressful. Oh. Yes. Diba? You don't have to think anymore kasi alam mo na kung saan ka pumunta. Yes. Diba? How many times did it happen na ba? No? Parang lagi kang may hinahanap. Yeah. And I swear to you, save so much of your time. Mm-hmm. Kasi alam mo na ngayon kung nasan yung mga ginagamit mo every day so. so second question how does it feel like now walking in your kitchen it feels good actually to talk in your kitchen it feels good to be honest with you like now every time I go down parang nasa mood na ako lalo to prepare ako feeling hindi mo na ako masyadong magaling magluto but parang ngayon mas naganahan ka to bake to cook because wala ang lina sa lahat tingnan so like what I told you kanina, grabe ina-affectuhan. Ang bilis kasi ma-affectuhan yung mood ko sa isang bagay. Which is um, wrong kasi hindi dapat ganun. Pero ang bilis kong, um, ayun ko, isang things lang hindi mag-work out. Parang isang thing hindi mag-work out mga ano na ako. Get affected. Yes. Parang hindi ko maruruhan siya or ma-affectuhan ako. And with this, isa siya sa nagpapasaya sa akin na yun. Because nakita ko yung Trina before. I'm happy na sa kitchen before kasi we got this house um na gawa na siya. So minor renovations na lang. And for the longest time, di ko naisip na bakit di ko nga i-renovate yung kitchen. Yeah. Because to be honest, di naman kasi ako talaga nagkakaroon ng much time here at home because I always work. Mm-hmm. And then no lockdown ko lang na-realize, isa sa realizations ko was, okay, um, pwede ka nga talaga mag-put ng, um, I mean, for me, I enjoy doing baking and then in cooking. So why not um, renovate that space into something that uh, will be useful? So then, yeah, then I start lang yung renovation, and then then I realized, okay, if this will make you happy, make me happy, okay, um, invest na natin. And then whoever will buy this house by the future, will be useful to the kitchen sa kanila, di ba? Yeah. Because so, probably people, they're thinking, uh, I mean, people are thinking na, oh, magpapagawa ng house ikaw. Yeah. And yet, Maybe yun yung tanong um, ng marami sa inyo, bakit um, magiging parang sayang naman, nagpa-renovate. But to be honest, um, I think that's very convenient kung sino man yung mag-oon itong our beloved house in the future because everything's ready. And may touch to ng neat obsession. Oh, so yeah. kung sino mang family yun, I hope that this will be uh, useful for them. And I think that's one thing also na parang nagiging ugali ng mga Pinoy, di ba? Mm-hmm. Na parang we're always nang hihinaya. Yeah. Like, di ba, parang hindi natin ginagamit yung mga magaganda plates. <laughs> kasi <laughs> pang-bisita. Pang- kasi pang-bisita lang. Yeah. You know, sometimes you really owe it to yourself also. Like, yeah. you deserve all the nicest things as well. Like, yes. you're going to stay here pa for, for like, like a year and maybe. more. Yes. Yeah. And, yeah, and you deserve it. Like, Thank you. You said the parent, <laughs> you want to go down and make sure and you make sure that you want to feel light and yeah. you know, parang feeling mo yung kitchen is very welcoming. Then, and then, you know, you want to put it with your friends or guests because you want to cook for them. Mm-hmm. Parang na yun, since everything's organized, you know, since everything's organized, Di ba, iniisip kasi may hiya ka talaga to invite kasi ang gulo-gulo ng gamit and wala akong time. Mm-hmm. But, kailangan talaga, I have to make time. And finally, nagkaroon ng time. So proud of you. Thank you! <laughs> Shut up. Okay. Uh, I don't know if we're the same, but I wanted to know what's okay. your favorite spot in the kitchen. Um, yan kanina ko pa, iniisip my favorite spot in the kitchen because so many. Wait, what the top two? Okay. okay. <laughs> Top two, I think um, this one. Okay. This area. Your baking area. The baking area. <laughs> Ako yung nag-label at nag-dikit. At nag-dikit. Oo, oh, <laughs> so siya yan. Siya sa kanya yan lahat. And also, I don't know, but I really like the sink. <laughs> I like the sink because um, yung na-save nating space, mas isa when drying the plates, mm-hmm. yung sa taas, isa yun sa asin, chak. Gusto ko. Yeah. So, those are my top two. You. Um, actually, natutuwa talaga ako sa'yo. Like when you mentioned na parang, I really want this and then when you showed the plate, it's my very good Yes! 
Oh my God, so may pera ka pinakita kay Miss Isan. Sabi niya, it's my dirty kitchen. Sabi ko, oh, okay. <laughs> nice. <laughs> so, ang galing. Yeah, so nakakakiling. So, it's yeah. nice that, you know, parang I have something in my dirty kitchen here in your home. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Uh, and your husband. That's yeah. his idea. Yeah, that's his idea. So, yes. Okay. Your favorite. What's your favorite? My favorite is that. This one. The one for cooking. For cooking. Okay. I just love like how it pops there. Yeah. Parang, it, it's very aesthetically pleasing. Yeah. Pero ang sarap niya sa mata. Ang sarap magluto. And what do you call this, Miss Isa? This is from Landers. From Landers and it's Lazy Susan. Lazy Susan, yes. <laughs> Before this, I told Miss Isa, pwede Miss Isa wala talagang gamit sa table. And then sabi niya, Kaf, um, it won't work because kulang yung storage natin. Let's just save that for the next house. But I promise you, na ilalagay niya daw sa mga um, naka-display is still pleasing naman. So, I agree. Parang nag-match naman siya. Okay. So, my last question, ka. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> mga pang mahirap to, ha? Okay. Oh, naman. So, what are your learnings from this project? Oh, ang dami! Ang daming learnings. Actually, I enjoyed doing this, the whole process with you. Um, si Mama din naging hands-on with this. Yeah. With Don and Kuya, my architect and Kuya Aaron, the contractor. Because, kasi nga, I think something, organizing is really something that I enjoy doing. Sabi ko ako yung Miss Isa mag-apprentice na ako sa kanya. <laughs> Which I, I, will, I, I will never in a million years afford you. Nay, 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 my biggest um lesson na talagang yun yung magagamit ko forever na is you have to you have to make time because I always um say na okay I'm so busy which is true naman yes. pero um sinabi ko kay Miss Isa kaya I'm gonna make time for this because hindi naman to mangyayari or hindi to magagawa ni Miss Isa kung hindi din ako game so for me um with the clients and Miss Isa in the future it's very important to have parang um, very uh, collaborative kayo yung dalo. So you have to make time for it para ma-feel mo because it's your home. But now I feel like mas naging homey na siya. And second siguro my learning um, would be yung on how to maintain it. Like what you mentioned kanina, hindi tayo pare-pareho ng lifestyle. And then ko lang na-realize na okay, before I thought um, organizing it just means by storing the things in the cabinet. But that's wrong. Depende pala siya kung paano yung flow niya dito sa kitchen. And it really works. Because now, um, mas mabilis lahat. Lahat para ngayon, alam mo kung saan makukunin yung mga gamit. And that's very helpful for me and everyone in this house. So, thank you for that. I can uh, I can name a lot of ano pa, lessons here. I can, ang dami ko talaga natutunan kay Miss Isa. But, those are my, ano na, my top two. Yeah. Thank you. You're, you actually, I'm, I'm very, like, in awe. Listen. Graduation na ba to? I'm very happy because that's really the goal. Like, for everyone to understand. Mm -hmm. like, all of us, as long as we're living in a house, yes. we are homemakers. Aww. And that in itself, like, your answer says it's Pasado? Oh, yes! Yay! <laughs> Like, okay. why every one of us is a homemaker? Like, you're very busy and yet you understand that it's really important. Mm -hmm. If it's your home, then you really have to be hands-on. Hands -on. And I think a lot of people can relate to that, Miss Isa, because it can really get overwhelming. You parang hindi mo alam kung saan ka magsisimula. So, I'm really lucky because I have Miss Isa here with me to guide me. And now this time, all of your cooking essentials are in this area. Mm -hmm. Kasi before, may mga pots and pans tayo doon, so I move yeah. na everything on this side para lahat ng pangluto. Dito lang ha. And dapat willing ka din talaga to learn kasi, um, yeah, I, again, it's your personal space. So, it can get really overwhelming sa simula, but we have new obsessions. <laughs> and yung mga pinapost Miss Isa, very helpful siya. So, thank you Miss Isa! <laughs> Because, okay, pwede naman hindi mo biglain yung sarili mo, <laughs> diba? Yeah. Little by little, and then, yan, tapos na. And nakakaaliw lang talaga ka. Parang it's really a treat whenever you message me. Middle of the night, <laughs> yeah. asking me how to fold socks. socks. <laughs> yeah. How to store the paper yeah. bags. <laughs> Ang dami pa sa Ang dami, bro. but nakakatuwa lang talaga. But this is just proves to show that, you know, no matter who you are, whether you're a mom, mm -hmm. a dad, a single professional, mm -hmm. a celebrity, and mm -hmm. that, 
you are still a homemaker. I really you have to care for the home. Yes. And I'm so happy. Thank you so much for this opportunity. Yay! Thank and you, thank you. We're done with one project and more to come. More rooms. More, more rooms <laughs> more to come. <laughs> one house, but more rooms, more rooms to, come. <laughs> to organize. But thank you, thank you so much. Thank for you. This opportunity. Thank you, Miss Isa. So I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Until the next one. Stay with everyone. So we have here now Miss Issa Reyes from Neat Obsessions. She's a professional organizer, an author, and a mom. And this book, the by Miss Issa, it's very personal because with, ano, with love, talaga niya ginawa to. So yeah, I hope you can get a copy. Hello, Miss Issa. Hello, Kat. Thank you for having me.